I really duped it there, man. I should have did better, but it wasn't really in the red. Let's go, go, ground, ground bait deployment. Boom. The feeder rod strikes. Okay, here we are, everybody. This is it. Windy Rivulet. Probably my favorite map of all the ones I've played so far. I really like it here. Um, let's give a short tour of the town, and then we'll learn it when we come back and sell fish and stock up. Workshop. Grocery store. One thing I did notice, as I did an intro before this, and it didn't, I didn't like it, but I think food and everything is cheaper here. Not by much, but... I think that was 40, I think that was 30, so a couple cents cheaper. Baits are completely wiped out here, as you'll see in a moment. But we got everything in the store there we need. This is new since I played in the fall. This is the farmer's market, and it's now functioning. We can get... We can get feed... We can get chicken eggs, potatoes, wheat grains. I'm thinking the eggs must be a binder for ground bait, maybe. Potatoes, that's new. We can do diced potatoes already. We don't have enough money. And that's getting into big fish. But we'll experiment with them soon. And wheat grains, that's a new bait too. I think you can make. We can't make it yet though. But we'll get some of this definitely before we leave. Because I, I don't know that every map has them. So, you got to try to take what's there. I guess that, for me, that's fun. Trying to figure all that out. Do it right. Administration, one large error, as I do not have the $5 needed to get the map. So, I will buy it at the end of the video, and maybe I'll even do a separate video on my fishing spots and Windy Rivulet. Let's check the record board. So, Asp, big asp. I mean, those are huge. That's like 13 pounds or more. Um, bleaks, blue bream. I think that's a new species here. Bream, burbot, big burbot. Catfish, huge. Chinese sleeper. That's nice to know. Chub, see, they get big and they get. Uh, cost common carp or fun to catch potatoes but they don't pay very good so I don't even want to risk my rod with that um, roaches crucian dace dace pay good donuts roof I think they pay good crayfish frogs gibbles grudgeon eyed nace perch pike mussels Xander Hinch. All right, we got we got a lot of potential here, but the populations I think are different. We will catch a lot more chubs and stuff than we did. You'll see. I guess I'll see too. And the bait stores down here. I did just do this, like I said, but I mean, all you can get is worms. And we can get up to here. These caddis flies definitely probably want to get some of them. I had good luck with them. And I don't know, we'll just have to get baits when we can. And we'll look into my skill tree when we're out fishing because I'm getting close to being able to make pearl barley and oatmeal dough, I believe. And then these egg dough, so that's what we use eggs for, I'm sure. But we're close to making pearl barley, and that is one of my favorite favorite baits. So to get to the spot I was right in town here, you take the bridge across, and then just hang a right. It's just after noon. There's fishing spots down there, but again, this all has current, so bobber fishing with multiple rods is not is easy. I don't seem to like it as much. So the optimum setup for me is to have two feeders 
or three feeders, but then you can do two feeders and cast, or you can do two feeders and then drift one bobber. That seems optimal for me. This is the little bayou off it. We get no we get no uh current in here. So I'm thinking of fishing here. Which looks like a good spot. I'm pretty sure it is, but I've also just fished pretty much in spots just like that. I want to do something different. And if I can get out here to the end, I can throw my feeder out into the main river. That's my hope. So, let's do a little testing with the TL20. TL20. Is current there. That has bread on it. TL16. We got worms. Let's go deeper. Let's go to 50. What are we going to throw on here for bait? How about a maggot to start? Okay, this is my first time using a spinning reel with all you guys, so R is your retrieval speed. I'm going to set it all the way up. And then your mouse, your mouse wheel is your drag, friction brake. I'm going to set it at about 22, 3 quarters. And give it a mighty hurl out towards that stuff. Not good at casting, as you can just see. That was very inaccurate. Okay, it's out. Sink to the bottom. You hit Y, and you take in your slack. And there you have it. Feeder number one deployed. Oh. We got a fish. Little sleeper? Yep, alright. We did not check. We... Did you see that? That's not a bad fish. Gibble. And I'm thinking then at midnight we are going to go ahead and deploy the rest of our Gibble Carp Mix. Oh, got one on the feeder. Did you hear that jingle? It's on there. There it goes. See it get slack? Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh, it's got some weight. Oh, 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 oh. You gotta really play the uh, drag. Oh, man. I'm gonna have to edit these down because on these little reels, this is probably going to take me a while. What did we get? Nice chub. That was not a very good landing. Sorry about that. And the bobber's gone. Back. Oh. I see other people pick them up and do different things. I'm pretty used to. I wait till I see some action and then I grab set hook immediately. This is a smaller one. Ooh, can't wait to see how much that money that chub is because I don't think we need to catch as many fish now. Nope. 
and Gibble Carp. Got it. We got there. Oh, this could be real good for a Gibble Carp mix then. That's a worm. Oh, we're doing all right. We got five fish. And if we can get increased gibble size a little. So I think what's happening is my lines are hitting the bottom. But if that keeps them stationary and I still catch fish, I'm okay with that. Can't wait to get two or three of them. Wait till you see that my favorite spot in the game that I found so far is down the river there. See, it starts turning into a big, huge bend with a big hole all along it. You know, the outside of it, the current dugout. And there's wood and stumps and logs all in there. It's excellent fishing. But it's pretty hard to fish there. Until, well, it's not hard to fish just want more feeder rods. We got it, and we got lightning storm. I think that might be good for Gibble. I mean, that's tiny, but what we need is some frickin'. I don't know what's going on. Oh, what's going on? Big old fish. Oh! 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 That sucks. Did you see that big old frickin' fish? I really duped it there, man. I should have did better, but it wasn't really in the red. Hmm. Oh, that's another big one. We'll try pumping it. Let's have a look. See, that's better. Oh, yeah. All right. That's probably what was on the other one. 21.8 on float fishing. All right, we're going to... We got a maggot on there. It looks like that could be a good little spot. Okay, let's see if we can fix the TL-16. We have our bobber. So... Hook. We'll go with the 12, which isn't really what I want to. And we'll go back with worms. So 23, I can almost stop them. Try pumping them a little. What? All right, did I? I lost it. Yeah. Ooh, big ol' common roach. Alright, so this stuff has given us some XP's too. Which is great. I'm thinking maybe one of our next ground bait. We find a nice roach place on this and make some roach. Or chub. I believe the ground bait is affected by the current too, so we can... We can try to use our brains and do that right. Look at that. No, 
another nice common roach. I mean, all right, that's XP's there. Whoa. Nothing big, but it's fish, and it's mine. I'm very rusty with the uh, feeders, but I didn't want to fish on my other account. I wanted to fish on this account, make video. And this one might be a long video, because I want to get some fishing and make it. I might do two days, so I might have to cut a lot out. I will show all fish. I'll try just to be quiet so it's easy to cut stuff out. I like to put in all my goofy stuff, I say. So we definitely, I think, found a good spot to do a roach. Oh. 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 And that is a nice gibble. Oh, 1kg gibble. We got Xander in here, though. That's like a wall. Oh, man, look at that. I turned my head for one second. Little sleeper? Yep. All right, another one. Don't know, looks like it could be a gibble. Black fins. And actually, that's not even a bad gibble. Look at the size of that gibble. We'll deploy ground bait shortly. Another roach? Yeah. Man, look at that thing run with it. This, as you can see, is a really good place to, ooh, 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 1.355 kgs. That's pretty awesome. All right, so we're on a hot spot. We might fish here. Feeder's going. I can't tell if we got one on there or not. I don't think so. Yep. Ooh, Rufy! Big fish. Alright, we got our attitudes getting all bent out of shape. We're going to have to fix that. Alright. You. Boom. Oh, it's got some weight. And I think that might be a frickin' roach. If it is, we're in business. No, that's a nice big gibble, though. Get that out there. Go you we get two more we can throw. And one right out here. Boom. Oh. Oh. Whoa, we got a fish on here. Come on. Oh, this I'm going to have to fast forward it or something so you guys can see. Ooh, all right. I don't I can't really go to 24 and it starts damaging your reel and stuff.
you see that yellow bar now that goes up when it gets orange and red you're going to break off and your reel and stuff will start taking damage so you can use your thing you know I can bump it up as the fish gets tired see right there we don't want it so I'm gonna go back down to 23 he's not pulling drag now so I am gaining on him a little there he goes Time I think I'm gaining on him, I just don't know. Strong fish. Could just be a common carp, which would kinda suck. 24 is right on the edge. He's still pulling. The feeder rod strikes. Do not want to lose it now. I'll look like a complete fool. But it does not matter. It's all about the fish. Strong fish. I've been fighting it for three and a half hours in game. Something like that. a big old common carp I think What the f Look at 
there. I got 21 fish, and I got a huge one here that I can't seem to get off my line. Oh, this is really sucking. It should be giving me that fish. <laughs> oh no, it got away. Whatever. Well, everyone you saw what was going on there. That's kind of a bummer, but you know what? Not really, because it wasn't going to pay that gray. I don't think it would have been. I don't wish I knew how big it was. All right, that's going to bank for crappy video. All right, well, let's try to get some more. All right, let's go through my skills. I've invested four points in float fishing, two is for the rod, one for the rig, and one for spinning reel, which actually then will work for spin fishing and bottom fishing. I got the simple, I've already put some skills in there. And spin fishing, I got one. Harvesting baits, I did one. Most of these don't. You open them up, they're full. This harvesting worms and red worms is the only one you can really put. Oh, there's some more blood worms. Twelve and a half percent from digging worms and making our bait. So we are getting there. At twenty percent, we can make pearl barley and oatmeal porridge. I'll start digging more worms offline. And look at them run. Ooh, perch. Nice one. Little gibble. It is rainy cloudy, so we should have good carp fishing all day. Three oh three gibble. Try to get it out there a little higher. Let's just try to finish this frickin' day off good. That should be a nice spot. Alright, everything's in. Ground bait should still be going. You know what we can do? Go to crafting, ground bait. What do we got? Roach mix. Bloodworm and caramel. Nope. Go with just try to make one thing a ground bait. I had a plan. I'm going to toss out ground bait stuff if it's no good. That one I'll keep, I think. What is the 90 cents? We don't have much money at all. It's 3 out of 10. We got some ground bait ready to go. And we got skill, more importantly. And in the next few videos, I'm going to try maybe just try our own ground bait, our own invention. God dang it. Got it?
Start slinging some fish up here. Man, that was disappointing. But you did see it. I caught a huge common carp. But there, I th I think they're they're uh, their prices are horrible. Oh. My attitude is in the toilet, people. I'll refuse to fish, I think. The line nice and tight. Oh. Definitely getting a bite there. We got him. Just a little one. Rainy day on Windy Riverlet, but we're at 30 fish. Common roach. Got it. This one. But we didn't lose anything. This got a little bit more size. Nothing special, but... Nice gibble. Hooked ya. Nice common roach. I think we have a problem. It's called a Cut the line, X. So we lost our sinker. And we lost our... You know what? We're uh, done fishing for the day, I guess. That'll do it. We'll get a couple more on these. Maybe? We did manage to almost get to level 9. Um, boom. Their sleeper? Yeah. Just a little one, but who knows? Maybe there'll be a... Something in the cafe for them. Got it. Another roach. Man, the roaches are killing it on the bread. Gibble? Yep. One more fish? Nah, let's just go. It's gonna be long. We'll go regroup. We got, what do we get for new species? We got a roofie. Rough, whatever. Let's check the cafe. Common roach, four pieces. Bang. 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 And we get six fifty nine for that. That's pretty nice, because those weren't two pieces of tiny Chinese giblets. Sleepers. And that's 345. And those are just small, worthless fish, pretty much. Roof? I had one. It's 10 bucks for that roof. I might do another one today. I'm going to save that roof. And we'll go for another. Look at that. I probably got that. Oh. Well, I caught it. It just glitched. All right, so we're at eleven dollars already. Here we go. Two ten gibble. I, you know, these ones with the green trophy. That means I think they're good size, so they you start getting money on them. These are just useless. 
six cents, three cents, forty seven cents, two sixty one, five ten gibble, dollar twenty six, one twenty eight gram, three cents, two ninety two gram, fifty two cents, four cents, three cents, three cents, three oh three gram, gibble, thirty seven cents, three cents, fifty eight cents for that perch. 270 grammers, only 8 cents. A 483 roach, $1.74. Little Chinese sleeper. A gibble, 5 cents. 209 for 845. 95 for 154 kg. That roof is $1.43. That big gibble, $3.35. Dollar seventeen, four twenty-six is a dollar four. Uh, one point zero seven two kg is two sixty-five. Dollar fifty-seven. Dollar fifty-seven. Two thirty. One point two six kg is three seventeen. Three cents. Thirty-seven cents. Eight cents. Dollar seventy-six for the chub. Boom. Uh, Gibble Carp, 39 cents for a total of 26.27. So we had very good day. That's what I'm talking about. Let's get our map. Always get the map. It is very helpful. And at the beginning of the next video, buy that. Now I feel like a real fisherman. You always should have a map here. My attitude is just bombed. I'm gonna have to take a break though. See if they got any coffee. Coffee's out. Of course, mulled wine is instant noodles, condensed milk. I'll probably buy another packet of tea. think we're really hurting maybe get we'll buy some vodka buy a bottle of vodka proletarian brand I think that vodka is more effective I want something that'll bring up that attitude jeez that's in the rain you're fishing in the rain you get crappy attitude I guess going to the bait store should cheer me up Bates. I'm going to buy them. Just, they're expensive. Just to have them. We got all kinds of ground bait stuff now. And we've got one batch made, too. We've got plenty of food, plenty of booze, maps, bell, hooks. I'm getting eight. Get two eights. And there we go. Well, we really didn't need those, but whatever. Um, all right, we're set. We're set, and we're on that bend pool I was talking about. There's a campfire. We can make tea. We got beer, we got lemonade, we got bread. All right, everybody have a nice day. Uh, we got a bunch of options for the next time, and if we make money like that, we'll be fishing awesome down on that bend pool in no time. So I'm going to probably do another one shortly after this, and hopefully that'll get us there. All right, have a good one, everybody. Please like and subscribe. What the f